Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have been given the length of the diagonal of this cube as square root of 6. We are asked to find the volume, surface area, and the lateral surface area of this cube. So let's look at the diagonal. Diagonal is this straight line that is a red straight line and that is we know that is square root of 6. And one more thing, just keep in your mind that the sides, all sides of a cube are equal and each side is, is A. So that means this height is A, this length is an A and this width is an A as well. And here it is step number one. We know that the diagonal of cube is A times square root of 3. This is the formula. And we have been given the length of the diagonal of a cube which is square root of 6. So I am going to write down that is going to give us I'm going to write down A times square root of 3 equal to square root of 6. I am going to equate them. So this way I can find the value of A. I am going to divide, I'm going to isolate A, I'm going to divide both sides by square root of 3. So we can see that this, these two radicals they cross out. So A turns out to be equal to square root of 2. This is the length of each side and here I give you a reasoning how I came up with this thing. Square root of 6 divided by 3 could be written as 6 over 3 in the, under the same radical and that could reduce to square root of 2. And one more thing, just keep in your mind that the unit length in our case is going to be centimeter. Now in step number two, we are going to find the volume of the cube and the formula is a power three. So volume, we go, let's go ahead and v equals to a in our case is square root of two and then it's a power three. And we know that the square root of two is approximately equal to 1.4142 we can just simply replace that one uh, 1.4142 power 3 and that is approximately going to give us 2.83 centimeter cube so thus the volume of the cube turns out to be approximately equal to 2.83 centimeter cube and in this next step, we are going to find the surface area of this cube. And we know that the formula is surface area equal to 6a squared. And here you can see that the surface area has six faces. That means four walls plus roof plus floor. That makes six faces. So let's go ahead and do this thing. Surface area, I'm going to say, S A stand for surface area equal to 6 A square. I'm going to replace A by square root of 2 and then square it and that is going to give us 6 times the square and square root cancel each other out. We got 2. 6 times 2 is 12 and this is going to be centimeter square. So thus the surface area of this cube turns out to be a 12 centimeter square. And finally in our step number four we are going to find the lateral surface area of this cube and the formula is lateral surface area equal to 4a square. And here you can see that the lateral surface area has four faces that means only four walls so let's go ahead and figure out this thing lateral surface area lsa equal to 4a square over here this is the formula 4 times a in our case is square root of 2 and then 
we are going to square it and we can see that this square and square root they undo each other so we got simply 4 times 2 which is equal to 8 centimeter square. So thus the lateral surface area of this cube turns out to be 8 centimeter square and that's it. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.